what is homemaking? I ask myself, why am I a homemaker? What am I doing that deserves the credit of being a homemaker? It is not the morning routine, getting up at 5 a.m., getting my Bible reading in, and getting my planner all set for the day or the week. It is not the time that I get to myself before the kids wake up, before I get breakfast ready and making a delicious homemade meal for my family. Even though those are wonderful things to have done and be able to do, that is not what it is. It is not the piles of laundry that we get to do every day or every other day and taking care of folding everybody's laundry and separating it out and feeling like this test never ends. That is not what being a homemaker is. And that is not the mindset that I want to have as a homemaker. As I clean the floors, as I have my little girl help me do some cleaning, it is not about how clean I'll have my wood floors in the bedroom or how well made my bed looks for all the people that who come in there, which is my husband and I. And it's not about all the nutritious snacks that I make for my family and how often I bake fresh goodies and have those set out for my kids or my husband. Again, all those things are wonderful and nice and part of homemaking, but that's not the goal. That is not my goal as a homemaker, is to be able to do all these things and get all the checklists done. That is just part of being a homemaker. That is the bonus we have of being a homemaker and caring for our homes. Being a homemaker to me is enjoying the little moments of going out and picking pumpkins and creating those memories and those moments with our loved ones, our kids, training our children in the ways of the Lord of how he wants us to care for our homes and how he wants us to be as people and followers of him. And being a homemaker is making sure that we have hearts of service and that we also have hearts of um, selflessness, but that we also take care of ourselves and being able to set the table nicely, being able to make homemade food. That is all part of being a homemaker. It is not the goal. The goal is not to make our house look wonderful and beautiful. There are days when it is not, but the goal is to serve and care for our families, to do the Lord's work with our hands, as Proverbs 31 says, to care for the people that God has entrusted us with, our spouses, our children, or if you're single or if you're just married. And that is the goal in homemaking that I have to remind myself of so that I can enjoy these peaceful moments at night knowing that I have done the Lord's work in taking care of my home and my family.